Hi guys, this is day 71 to 80 of Andyman St. Paolo's adventure. But before we get into it, we just hit 4,500 subscribers. That's absolutely amazing. And my next goal is 5,000. And if you want to help the channel out, go down and subscribe now. Now let's get on with the video. All right, day 71. We got a lot to do in the next 10 days. I think what we're going to do is try and push up to this area and clear it out a little bit. Take the old mini 14 up there and start blasting fools. Uh, we are a little bit hungry. I do want to starve ourselves because we're 83 weight. So we're going to be eating stuff like, I suppose, pineapple's okay. See how that does. Um, let's just um, get that in our gob. So it's made us... Yeah, it's taking a hunger away. It's not giving us calories. So that's good. That's good. It's a decent time we woke up. We'll fill all of our stuff up. We'll head on down, I think. Get right into the action. That way as well, we can assess what it's like down there. And we can, you know, fire a few shots. Leave it for a couple of days. All right. So we've parked a little way away. Because in case it gets a little bit, uh, a little bit tasty. And we need to uh, escape. The zombies are already coming over to us. And I feel they could be running out of these houses as well. So we'll use the baton for a bit. All right, let's get the uh, the rifle out, I think, and stop blasting. Yeah, it's not very good range on the uh, Mini-14, but you know what? It's uh, it's a good gun, I think. we got a few coming down to us. Looks like we got this school. We never actually went in this school, did we? Maybe we check that out. All right, we got a fair few coming on over now, which is uh, which is good, I suppose. Get some to us. We're nice and uh, safe in the open. Well, safe fish in the open here. Oh, we got a stalker. We got a stalker. They got good armor. Let's let's draw them. Look at the hair. We'll draw them over to us, and we may take their armor if it's in good condition. Nice. Yeah, all in good condition by the looks. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Perfect. And our baton's nearly uh, nearly done for, so we might switch to a hammer. All right, let's go and have a look how many more are up here. Hopefully not that many, to be honest. Let's also go have a little look in this um, school as well. Find out what it is. There might be something in there. Yeah, I definitely think the Mini 14 has a smaller sound radius than the other rifles because we was blasted around here. And we got a few, but not, you know, crazy amounts. All right, we're in, we're in. Yeah, it's definitely a school. No, the baton, it's gone, it's gone. Ah, damn it. Okay, let's, uh, let's put the, let's use the hammer. Uh, so we got a soccer pitch. Uh, we would call it a football pitch, but uh, yeah, soccer. All right, let's get out of here. It's a bit too, a uh, bit too claustrophobic for me, to be honest. Do we need any other magazines? I don't really think so. You know, this guy just hiding in the corner there. Come on, lady. All right, let's push on now. Let's have a look. Let's bring the old mappage up. See how we're looking. So yeah, maybe we, uh, maybe we. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe we drive down to the hospital and get get all them zombies coming over to us. All right, we got some coming over after we fired the rifle, so hopefully that'll bring them towards us. They can come to us this time. Oh, we got a policeman. Did they have a baton on them? No, they didn't. Okay, that's fine. All right, well, we definitely uh, cleared out a lot of them. I think maybe we head back for the day and sort out our new stuff. Oh, we need leather. We need leather. Okay, that's what we got to do. So he's going to get rid of this jacket anyway, won't we? Right, we need to go through the bodies and find leather. Surely we've killed enough zombies with leather on them. Do you know what? I don't think we actually have, to be fair. Um, well, that is not good. We do have four strips, but that, that isn't going to be enough, is it, really? Oh, I think we've got another one over here. Yeah, we'll start getting tired. We've got a few bits. We've got about 14, 15 bits. We'll go back to base, see what we can do with that tomorrow. If not, we'll go down to the... Um, east uh, to the high street where we was yesterday and i mean there's plenty of zombies down there i'm sure they'll have leather on them all right it's half past 10 we're gonna go to bed tomorrow we're gonna sort out the new equipment um also fill our propane torch up uh, and maybe go look, look for some leather that could be on the cars but uh, we'll see you in the morning all right day 72 let's have a look at this does it hinder us at all no it doesn't let's see if it's better than the prepper stuff the trousers are so what the trousers 25 35 let's have a quick look 15 25 so yeah they are quite a bit better so i'm gonna hazard a guess and say the top is 40 60 yes a hell of a lot better so we can actually take the strips uh, oh we've got some in here haven't we we've got one in here we will keep all of them because well why the hell not 
Uh, oh, wow, we are, uh, yeah, no pants gang. And look at them socks. Look how dirty we are. Maybe we should have a wash as well. All right, we've got the stalker jacket. Let's pop that on. Let's have a look how good it looks. Oh, yeah, it does look good. We can also take the strips off of this as well. Oh, yeah, we're rocking. I think I'm going to keep these uh, these desert boots on, actually. I quite like that. I quite like the look of that together. Especially with the leather strips. It kind of matches. Oh, he does look good with the cloak. But then, what, what, you know, what? How, what are we going to do if we need to dismantle anything? I mean, we could put it on our backpack. We could add a utility slot to it and add it. Yeah, let's... Ah, oh, but then it's just more weight we're carrying. But it does look bloody cool with this uh, cloak on. Nah, safety first. Safety first. I'm also thinking, do we take an M14? Because it's got better range with the scope on, maybe? Uh, no, let's keep the mini for a little bit. I like the mini. All right, it's 11 o'clock. We've washed ourselves. We're having some uh, canned pineapple. Then I think we're going to go to bed. And tomorrow, what we're going to do... We're going to go down and look at this area. I want to see what this is. This blue building and this here. This could be a little police station. I don't know, but I want to I want to see them and mark them off. And then we're going to look at some other places up here. So, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the morning. All right. Day 73. Oh, where the hell am I going? Not in there. Day 73. Let's get some food. We've got plenty of ammo. We've got another machete on us. Water's probably fine, but we'll fill up anyway, and we'll go down and look at them, uh, them blue buildings to the south there. All right, we're having a cabbage salad because we do have quite a bit in there, more than I uh, realised actually in the fr in the freezer. And <laughs> we've got a uh, quite a bit in there, so we don't really need to worry. Um, and it should, yeah, we're still dropping weight, which is good. Maybe we take one with us just for uh, just for good luck. Let's uh, let's get down there and see what them buildings are. All right, so we're at the gas station. I don't think we've actually ever been. To south of this have we oh the zombies have come back to the gas station that's fine though oh we're on the highway here uncharted territory right we didn't draw that many zombies over to us so that's a good start we're gonna get all dirty again after we just cleaned ourselves but that's that's the way it is in a zombie apocalypse well that's a fair few of them cleared out we still got a few more over here by this building by the looks of it but i'm sure we'll make a short work of them bastards what is it? Oh, we got a place for now. We might be able to get a baton off of her. Um, no, no baton. Oh, it's a bloody restaurant. All right. Oh, we got another nomad. Um, what they got on them? Oh, it's just their hair clipping through. Okay. Well, see you later. We don't really need anything else off of you. We've got a. Actually, what else do you have? Uh, we'll take your cereal and your sardines. Actually, uh, I think this is this is too big to be a restaurant, isn't it? It's got to be something. I think it's actually a motel. <laughs> oh, we might be able to get some batons from in here, maybe. And five policemen. Surely one of them's got one. Yes, we got the nightstick. Get in. That is nice. <gasps> oh, 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 look at this. Look at this. This is what we wanted all along. Wow, brilliant. Not a suppressed one, but I don't mind. I'll take it. Mm, just a shotgun in the other one and some shells. Don't really need that. Yeah, I think this is a motel, so not amazing find. But yeah, so blue must be leisure then. Light blue must be leisure. Oh, we do have a lot of bloody zombies in here though. Let's deal with them jokers. Yeah, we could probably mark this off as done because we don't really need a motel. Maybe if we wanted to do some carpentry to get our levels up, but nah. We will go on over to this building here, though, because this could be a police station. Nope, looks like it's a uh, bus depot. <laughs> well, at least we've been down here now. We've explored it. Let's also mark that off the map as well, I think. Well, a bloody good haul, I'd say. It was worth coming down here just for uh, just for the good quality MP5. Um, we're definitely going to use that, I think. All right, we're back home. Anything in the boot? Nope, that's fine. We're going to sort our, our uh, ill-gotten gains out. Ah, we need we need another crate. We, we need another crate for ammo. God damn it. All right, 20 past uh, 11. We're going to go to bed. Tomorrow, we're going to explore some more areas, I think. But we'll, uh, we'll see you then. All right, day 74. Today, I think what we're going to do... Yeah, we're going to push up here. We're going to push up the high street, I think, and have a look at this blue building. Kill some zombies on the way. But more importantly, test out the mp5 so i'm looking forward to this look it's even got a flashlight you can get a suppressed version of this but we don't have it we just have the standard one so it is what it is we'll get some salad get some cabbage salad for breakfast and take one with us and then we're uh, we're good to go what is our weight actually um 81 dropping us fine so when we get to like 79 we'll look at you know maybe increasing some calories uh but until then we're uh we're happy days oh no cabbage is stale no Oh no, we don't have any more in the fridge. All right, let's get to it. Still on the lookout for a generator. I don't think we're going to find one, to be honest, but I'm not too worried. I mean, we've, 
We've got plenty of fuel. We, you know, we've hardly used any in the last, what, 10, 15 days. Got a few zombies here. Oh, we got quite... Oh, this is where we was, wasn't it? Um, the other day. Okay, let's, uh... Let's park up here. Let's try to test out the MP5 on these bastards. Pretty nice, pretty nice. It looks like it's better closer range, one shot killer, which is fine. That's what we're kind of going to use it for. Nice 30 round mag as well. That is really nice. Durability is not the best I know. <laughs> Pretty good, pretty good, I won't lie. I like it, I like it. Yeah, we may not even need uh, to increase our mechanics because I mean, our engine is absolutely fine. We may look at the tires when we get back to base, actually, because they have probably had a beating. Right, I think we just power on through, you know, up here, see what we got. There's a lot of zombies because they all burst out that door. There is a lot of zombies and a lot of wrecks, actually. All right, so we've made it up. It is very busy here. I'm not too sure what the plan is. Park over here, we should be okay. Don't really want to use the gun. I think that's a bit too risky. We got bowlers because there is a bowling alley. That is a bowling alley. So maybe we check that out as well. Yeah, that is a police station. Okay, let's get in there. We could have batons for days. Well, I suppose it's actually called a nightstick in the game, isn't it? But I prefer baton. So yeah, a nice suppressed weapon is what we're actually looking for in here. Actually got another nightstick as well. And it looks like this guy's got one on him as well. So we'll be having that. Thank you very much, sir. All right, we are in. Doesn't look too busy. Got a zombie over here banging around. Oh, okay. Oh, we got a key. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, it looks okay. Uh, we just got to be careful. All right, so we're in the armory. Um, there's ammo, which we don't really need. We got plenty of ammo. We'll take the... Uh, the 9mm beans were here, though. Why the hell not? No, there is not a lot here at all. Well, there's ammo, but like I said, we don't really need ammo. Maybe we spend the night in the cells. Uh, nah, maybe not. <laughs> well, there wasn't really a lot in there, was there? Let's go and have a look at these buildings up here, because I kind of... Let's, like, let's mark this off, actually, first, so I don't forget. And it looks like we've got some kind of leisure centre there. That's government, so... Hmm, yeah, I don't know about that. Let's go and have a look at this bowling alley, I think. Oh, we got a lot of zombies. Actually, shall we get the... Let's get the MP5 out. Why the hell not? Let's risk it. That was very impulsive. I don't know if that was the right idea. Oh, God, they're coming from where the car is. Oh, God, they are. What have we done? Let's try... Let me refresh my memory what these blue things are up here. Maybe, like... I don't actually know. I really don't know. Oh, God, look at them all. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, let's get out of here. Oh god, I'm hitting stuff. This ain't good, this ain't good. Get off the road, get off the grass. I mean, the car is durable with the bull bar and everything on, but still. Oh my god, look at them all! Oh yeah, we do need a smoke after that. Bloody hell. Oh, home sweet home. <laughs> HUD's still at 94%, so that is good. What about the rest of the stuff? So, yeah, we hit a few zombies, but we're still we're still golden. All right, it's uh, 20 past 10. We're going to get a bed tomorrow. We may just hang around base after that scare. Um, I don't know if my heart can take it, to be honest, but we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 75. We are good. We are very hungry, so uh, our cabbage out there has, still hasn't grown. But our cabbage in the fridge will have defrosted, which is good. I'm thinking we go up uh, up behind this area here, move the, with the rifle with an eight times and just blast with the M14 possibly. That could be the play here, I think. But today, we're going to chill, take stock of our guns and ammo, and go from there, really. All right, so we've tidied the front of the lawn up. It looks like we've got grass growing back over here, so we're actually going to deal with that because I hate the grass. What would the neighbours think? All right, it's, 20, it's half past 11. We're going to get a bed. Um... We, are, we do have a heavy load, and I think it's all the ammo we got. I mean, do we need... I mean, we probably do need 243 rounds, to be fair. So we're going to have to keep an eye on that. Maybe maybe we leave the maybe we leave the propane torch here for the time being. Is that even going to bring us down? We're still heavy load. What can we get rid of? I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. But we're going to go to bed, and we'll, uh, we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 76. We're going to hang around base for a little bit because it's still a bit dark out. So I get some uh, cabbage salad and then go uh, go smoke some fools up by the uh, community center or the school or whatever it was. 
try and clear as many as we can to finally push we're gonna yeah go up here to the school yeah it was the school slowly start shooting bring them down to his park around here draw as many of them out of this area as we can and then i mean molotovs would work but then you know we've got the risk of it burning the whole place down which we kind of want to explore it that's that's the whole reason for these you know we want to explore these areas, but all right, well, our belly is full, our inventory is full, we are heavy low. But then as we start shooting, it's going to use the bullets. Um, we got the eight times, so that's going to be nice. Um, yeah, let's go and see uh, what kind of carnage we can cause up there, really. Slowly clearing our way up there. That's the way you got to do it. You know, you got to... Oh, jeez. Oh, Jesus Christ, that could have been bad. Woo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. Um, yeah, as I was saying, you you got to clear... you you got to make sure your rear is protected. That's what I say. Right, let's uh, park over here, actually, because it looks like we're starting to get a bit busy with the zombies already. All right, let's go to town. Let's try this eight times out. Oh, look at that. Look at that range. Oh, not going to be any good close range, but I ain't worried about that. Like shooting fish in a barrel. This is Jesus. Oh, this uh, immediate area is nice and cleared. Oh, yeah, there's a fair few up there. That's fine. Bring them on down. Bring them to the party. Deal with that guy in there. Oh, we got some jokers here coming in to get involved. There is a lot. I don't think we can take them with the machete, you know. Bloody hell, yeah, there is a lot. <laughs> oh, we got a fair few of them, to be fair. Oh, they're coming behind us. Hold the line! Okay, so they've got distracted. That's fine. We can go machete, I think, now. Oh, okay. That's good. That's good. We've got these here. It's all bringing them down from up north, which is good. Welcome to the party, pal. Ah, oh, the machete's gone. No, we don't have a spare. we got to retreat. 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 Right, let's get out of here. Let's get out. Did I bring a spare machete? No, I didn't. Okay. Right, let's go, let's go. We'll come back, uh, we'll come back tomorrow. Yeah, there's a lot of them. This has been repaired once. We could probably repair it again, I think. Ammo-wise, we're looking okay. Yeah, we've well fed, well stuffed. We uh, got fairly heavy loads, so we're gonna have to keep on our, keep our food up and then, uh, we're on 79. Uh, and then we won't uh, suffer so much with carrying all the ammo in it and all that stuff with. All right, it's 11 o'clock. We're gonna check the generator, see uh, how that's getting on because it's been a few days, I think, since I last checked here. Uh, we've still got four days. We may as well fill it up now while we're here. Why the hell not? Ain't gonna hurt, is it? That was our rain collector. Uh, it's okay. Hopefully we'll get some rain, um, but we're gonna have a smoke and we're gonna go to bed and we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 77, we woke up, and would you look at that? We have rain. Amazing. It is a storm. We may not go back down there in the storm. I think that's a little bit risky. Let's go and have a look what visibility is like out there. Do we have something with calories and treat old Andy man? I mean, he has done bloody well. What we got? Nearly 5,000 zombie kills. So, you know what? Let's treat him. Let's give him Let's give him some chocolate. Why the hell not, eh? Yeah, this is a, this is another storm coming. Um, I guess we get some storms in September. But I will not be going down in uh, in this weather. No. Well, the storm is still raging on out here, which isn't good. So it looks like today is a write-off. We've been rained off today in our quest to take back St. Paolo's Hammer. Hopefully it will go overnight. We may as well fill our stuff up and have a wash, actually, while uh, while it's raining. We are drenched, so let's see if we got a... I did have a dish rag somewhere there we go is it dry do they dry on their own i don't think i think that's the first time i ever used it and there we go we're just a little bit wet now oh okay all right it's uh 20 past 10 yep we didn't uh the rain the storm didn't go it looks like it's calming down though which is good so tomorrow hopefully we should be able to uh get on out and carry on up there but that's a problem for tomorrow so we're gonna hit the hay and we'll see you uh, in the morning Right, day 78. We've woken up at 20 to 5 because we did go to bed quite early because of the rain. It looks like the storm's gone. It is raining. I don't mind a bit of rain, so that's fine. But we are going to wait until it gets a bit lighter outside and then we're going we're gonna to crack on. We've ran out of cabbage in the freezer, in the fridge again. Let's move a load over. I uh, just realized we don't have a lighter either. Uh, well, we do, but it's empty. Now uh, that one's full. Nice, nice, nice. Let's have a smoke. Fill our uh, water containers up while it's raining and then we are uh, we're off we're off down there again to uh to the school to the carnage let's get cracking oh we got our first candidates looks like they've moved down a little bit towards our base which is an ideal 
Oh, the massacre again. What is this? Massacre 3.0? I think it might be. All right, let's get the gun out. Oh, God, they're coming from this side. Jesus. They're coming from everywhere. All right, I think we got a lot of them. There's probably still more lurking around, but... Oh, we've made it behind the school. We've still got a fair way to go, but hopefully if we start shooting here, it's going to keep bringing them down and bringing them down. And eventually when we get there, we'll... out of ammo well out of ammo in our mags let's actually let's get the machete let's do what we do best the machete oh okay let's reload our mags now so many bodies will probably start getting corpse sickness soon i reckon a the cars down there well we really need it we do need fuel but i actually think we'll be all right for fuel oh jesus didn't realize, realize she was there Come on, lady. Oh, we got our next uh, candidates here. You gotta be careful, because behind us, you see them two gates, they'll be coming out of there. Oh, we're gonna start a jam as well, which is an ideal. But, uh, it is what it is. Looks okay behind us. i uh, got a couple here. Always, uh, always cover your rear, that's what I say. Ah, oh, they're starting to come from the sides now. That's fine, though. Ah, there goes the machete. This one will be going, I think, so we repaired it twice. Uh, and it didn't last a long uh it didn't last very long once we'd uh, repaired it that last time either. This one's a brand spanger. Well not brand spanger, but it's never been repaired. It's, and it's got good condition, so. Oh, we are getting through them alright. Right, okay, it's twenty to four. We're gonna head back, I think. Yeah, we're going to start getting tired soon. Anyway. We're out of rifle ammo, so yeah, let's let's head back. Just look at all of these bodies. What is our kill count now? Let's have a quick look. Uh, five and a half thousand. Brilliant. Well, we're doing something right. All right, we are home. We're going to relax for the rest of the day after all of that carnage. What is our aiming skill at now? Okay, so we are actually getting close to number level five, which is nice. All right, it's 10 to 11. We're very tired, a little bit wet. We've got another storm coming. Uh, but I think anyway, tomorrow uh, and maybe even the next day as well, we're going to hang around base because we want them bodies to despawn. We're slowly, slowly pushing up there. Um, where, where do we get to here? So yeah, we are getting there and it's drawing them all close all to us funneling them through to us Which is good as I say with them uh, If we let the bodies despawn we can drive up there better without worrying about the car Tires or even rolling and flipping the car which you know It could happen with me driving we all know this um, But we're gonna hit the hay and we'll, uh, we'll see you in the morning All right day 79 okay. Yeah, the storm's still raging so we probably wouldn't go out anyway in this not with the high zombie pop that we've got on this map. It's just, it just doesn't worth it. Yeah, look at this. Bloody hell. My God, and it's it's 20 past 7. Like, it should be light. Okay, well, there you go. Well, we did have some cereal yesterday, so I'll wait as leveled off at 79. But I think we're going to get some more because we could do with... We could do with putting a little bit of weight on. I don't want to go too crazy. I don't want two chevrons. Maybe just one nice... Oh, all right. We got two chevrons. Um, that shouldn't take us past 85, though. If we do a bit of running... Maybe I'll do a bit of running around the base. A bit of jogging, I think. Uh, we did a couple of laps around the house, but I don't really think it's going to do anything. We are getting a little bit exhausted as well. But, yeah, we're just, uh, we're just chilling. Maybe we have a... Oh, you know what? Maybe. Maybe we treat ourselves and have um, a little bit of bourbon. Did we do that? No, no, no. We save it. We save it for Molotovs if we need to. Scorched Earth. Looks like the storm is going, which is nice. Well, the storm has stopped at 10 to 7 in the evening. So, you know, we, we would have had a little bit of daytime, but we wouldn't have been doing anything at this kind of time anyway. But, well, at least it stopped. And it's filled our rain collectors up, which is nice. Always nice. Mm, still got two chevrons. Okay. Mm, hopefully when we sleep, we'll drop down a one. But uh, speaking of sleep, it's uh, 10 past 11. Time for bed. We'll see you in the morning for day 80 wow all right day 80 and look at that on 80 weight as well one chevron up that's fine that'll do as i think we'll probably cabbage it from now on again we're just gonna chill we're just gonna chill we're not gonna do anything crazy um on the last day of a 10 day stint 
it's just not how I roll, you know. I'm not I'm not that crazy. Uh forget about a salad, just give me a cabbage. These are coming on. Let's have a look at the info. They should be well watered, flourishing, grow oh, we don't know enough yet. Uh maybe, you know, maybe we read farming. Oh, we didn't even get oh <laughs> we didn't even get two levels from that other crop. Uh we should get there easy things. We actually planted more. We only had what four or four five crops last time yeah the neighborhood's definitely getting overgrown isn't it at least our uh our patch is nice and clean i quite like the trees coming here and it's logs if we need them as well got this guy here absolute joker cut your head off ah 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 zombie dismemberment would be pretty cool actually i think i saw a reddit post on it before asking about it saying it'd be cool it really would be i mean there probably is a mod for it to be honest uh, i might look into that all right but it's 20 past one on day 80 so yeah we've uh we've made it